What's going on everyone? Um, I'm back here with another unboxing video and today I'm going to actually be unboxing another laser uh, that I purchased off of eBay. Uh, this will be my third laser uh, that I have purchased and the color that I got is red um, and I purchased it for about give or take eight dollars and fifty cents after like taxes and everything like that. Um, it did have free shipping, so that's good. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, uh, let's go ahead and get it out of the po uh, uh, package here. Uh, and it should have come with a battery as well, so I'm hoping is, uh, that that is the case. Uh, so there's the laser, and yes, there's the battery. Okay, so let's go ahead and put, put that thing off to the side. Okay, so let's go ahead and crack open the battery real quick. Let's get it out of here. Okay, so once again, uh, this particular laser uses the exact same battery as my purple slash violet and green lasers. So there is no uh, difference with the battery. It still uses uh, the... Uh, my camera's still being stupid with focusing. Uh, but it still uses the 16340 1200 mAh uh, 3.7 volt ultra fire battery, uh, which is of course rechargeable. So it's nice that it still uses that type of battery. Um, so now let's go ahead and get the laser out here. Let me cut the tape off of this. All right. Okay, get it out of the bubble wrap. Okay, so there it is. Um, as you can probably notice right away, uh, this particular laser has a different design uh, than my purple and green lasers. Um, this one, I don't know, it seems a bit longer, I guess. Um, and you, stu uh, you do still get the uh, wrist strap, <coughs> just like the other lasers. Um, one interesting thing about this particular laser, though, is it comes with a light refraction adapter accessory, essentially. Uh, and it screws onto the top here. It's already pre-installed. I'll go and see if the camera will focus in here. There we are. So as you can see, you could screw off this top portion here. And this little cap right here is the light refraction adapter. That's what they called it on the website. And essentially what it does is it will re refract the laser's beam and essentially make a bunch of little dots spread out all over the area that you're pointing the laser, uh, which I will demonstrate in just a second once I put the battery in. Uh, but yeah, once you take this adapter off, you'll get a the standard uh, laser beam that you will come to, or that you're used to, that just doesn't have any effects on it. Uh, but yeah, so I'll put that on in just a second. Um, <clears throat> now to put the battery in, you screw off the bottom like usual, so take that off, and then the battery goes, uh, let's see, let me just double check this, okay, so the plus, or the positive side goes down inside, and then the negative side is upward, so let's go ahead and put that in, and screw this back on, alright, let's see if it works, there we go, ooh, that's a really, really bright beam, that is for sure, so let's go ahead and focus back into the floor. Okay. But yeah, there it is. You can see it's really, really bright. It gives off a nice illumination. So it's not dim at all. Real powerful. Exactly what you're wanting when you purchase a laser of this type. Now, to give a demonstration of that little adapter that I was talking about earlier, let's go ahead and screw that back on. And let's do this again. There you go. As you can see, it refracts the light into a bunch of little dots on the floor and if you turn the little adapter thing as you can see it changes the pattern which is really really cool in my opinion it, i could stare at this for hours to be honest like it's just kind of really really unique and kind of interesting and the farther you go up uh the more spread out the dots become the more of them essentially end up being there so that's pretty cool and then, of course, when you take that off, you get the basic laser beam. 
So, <clears throat> overall, this is a nice laser for the uh, price. Uh, you get that cool adapter, you get a battery, uh, and it's powerful. Overall, it is a fantastic laser for the price. Really, really nice, and I would certainly recommend picking up this particular red laser if you guys are in the market for a red laser pointer. Um, now, <clears throat> let me just turn on all three of the lasers real quick. Oh, actually, before I do that, uh, here is the design to the previous one that I was talking about. This one seems a bit longer and more contoured and just seems more ergonomic and straight. This one seems a bit more chunky. Um, another thing to notice is this red laser is not focusable, whereas the other two are. So we could turn this little wheel and it'll adjust the size of the laser beam. But anyway, let me turn all of the lasers on and just give you a look at what all three look like next to one another. So there's the red, there's green, and then there's the purplish blue color. As you can see, of course, the purplish blue isn't as bright because it's ultraviolet. UV light. Um, but yeah, there you go. All three of the major colors of the laser pointers. Um, yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Um, I will post a link in the description below for you guys to purchase this laser if you're interested. <coughs> uh, but yeah, with that being said, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Uh, hit the subscribe button right down there. Uh, thumbs up the video. Always appreciate that. Also, if you guys have any comments or questions, I'll leave those in the section below. <clears throat> and I will get back to them as soon as I can. So, yeah, once again, with that being said, hope you guys have enjoyed this little unboxing video. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.